Epri conducts research and development relating to generation, delivery, and use of electricity for the benefit of the public. During welding, defects frequently occur. The objective and scope of this project is to use sound and vibration to investigate whether a good weld can be differentiated from a bad weld. If possible, machine learning will be used to provide feedback in real time to the welder. Our design includes two microphones and two accelerometers attached to the semi-automated weld head using holders that we designed. The two microphones B and C are used to detect sound and cancel out any outside noise. The two accelerometers E and F are used to capture vibrations and also cancel out any unwanted vibrations from the moving weld head. This is a weld with a normal wire feed. This will result in a non-defective and ideal weld. You can see that the normal wire feed weld results in no major spikes in our FFT or charts. This is our base weld. A high wire feed weld is where the wire feed is positioned too high, resulting in a dripping and puddling of the weld. You can see the dripping here, which produces a distinct noise. The noise from the high wire feed causes spikes in our FFT and charts, which indicates that a possible defect is occurring. A low wire feed weld is when the wire feed is too low, causing the line to drag on the surface and makes the wire excessively vibrate. Our charts from the accelerometer show a clear indication that the wire feed is dragging and potentially creating a defect. Based on our testing and analysis, we developed some parameters to send an alert to the welder when the wire feed is either too high or too low. Future applications of this project will be used in nuclear power plant welding operations. Utilizing the conclusions reached from the data analysis, welding can be done with excellent quality control. This will increase productivity and reduce costs to the power companies.